Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been really long since I posted a recipe video, but here I am with a healthy Valentine's Day recipe. I hope you guys will try this recipe on this Valentine's Day and make your loved ones happy. So let's get started. Into a mixer, I'm adding half a cup of rolled oats, one third cup of almonds, and grind them into a fine powder. Then add one dates. 2 tablespoons of extra virgin coconut oil and a pinch of salt. So this is how the mixture looks after grinding. If the mixture is too crumbly, you can add up to 2 tablespoons of hot water. So I'm using the cupcake mold to make the tarts. Lightly grease it with some extra virgin coconut oil. It's very easy to make the tarts. All you need to do is put the mixture into these cupcake molds and press them with your thumb and make it into tart shapes. As I said earlier, if you think your mixture is too crumbly, you can add up to 2 tablespoons of hot water and make it more easily moldable. So I've made 6 tart shells here. I'm gonna bake them at 180 degrees Celsius preheated oven for at least 12 minutes. And now I'll show you guys how to make heart shaped strawberries. First, remove the leaf on top of it and slightly trim the top part and slice them into two pieces. Now slightly trim the side of the strawberries like this and join them together to make the heart shape. Look how gorgeous they look. Doesn't it look like Valentine's Day already? So our tart shells are out of the oven. Make sure you cool them down at least for 20 minutes before you demold them. As these are gluten free tarts, make sure you take them out carefully. To make the chocolate ganache, I'm adding 70 grams of 75% dark chocolate. 1 tablespoon of extra virgin coconut oil. You can add any milk of your choice, add 3 tablespoons of it. And then let's microwave this mixture for 30 seconds. Make sure you do not microwave this mixture for more than 30 seconds in one interval. Microwave them in 10 second intervals until you reach the smooth and creamy texture. Now I'm glazing the strawberries with a teaspoon of honey. This step is totally optional but if you're going to do this, the strawberries will look nice and glazed. So I've demolded the tart shells and this is how they look. I've transferred the ganache into a piping bag and let's pipe these tarts with some chocolate ganache. And finally, our Valentine's Day special chocolate strawberry tarts are ready. They will be a perfect dessert to make this Valentine's Day and they are healthy as we have added only wholesome ingredients to them. So hope you guys will try this recipe. Until the next video, take care and bye bye.